Alrighty, what is going on guys? This is Red Sun and welcome back to another Battlefront 2 video video and today we've got actually a space map now to change things up and today actually the space map is called uh, a New Republic Battle, I believe. New Republic Space Battle and actually we're gonna start as the Empire. The main highlight of both of these um, is actually the ships that are included. For the Empire, of course, as we see here is the TIE Defender and for the New Republic we have the E-Wing. Wait, why am I? Wow, big fail! I'm attacking my own stuff. I'm. <laughs> no, I, I think the reason why I'm doing that is because I uh, just played as just played as the New Republic just to play it and test it out. Um, and yeah, as the New Republic, I stole a Tide Defender because in terms of like bombing runs and destructive capability, this this ship is a monster. <laughs> The E-Wing is pretty good too, but that's like used for, I for me, I I guess it's just primarily a starfighter, um, starfighter hunter kind of thing, or I don't know, like a a ship that just primarily is used for dogfighting. It because its missiles are pretty freaking powerful against ships, against some like I guess shields and other um, objective things. Not so much. So yeah, I mean, and again, also changing things up. Not really going into the hangar and destroying stuff from the inside for once. Like I always do. I always do this, so. But just changing things up, we're just gonna bombard their shields. And the regular blaster is also pretty good too. Unfortunately, I don't know what the problem is, but th for some reason this tie, this uh, the tie defender, um, can't lock on to ships or starfighters. And when it does, it doesn't want to like you know, uh, use uh, its missiles against it. So or lock onto it with missiles. So you gotta like literally aim it for this. Ah! Where'd this white wing go? I just want to get one kill. Okay. I mean, so yeah, you can lock on to ships, but the missiles for some reason just won't, you know, work. Good thing with like a ship like this K-Wing. I'm surprised the K-Wing is a troop transport for this because it's, it's a heavy bomber. The K-Wing is a heavy bomber. It's not really a troop transport, but uh, I don't know where this thing's going. Yeah, good job. <laughs> uh oh, the rebel team's actually winning. What the heck? That's a surprise. Oh, almost freaking crashed into my own guy. Or just, or I did crash into my own guy. I didn't completely kamikaze though. The cool thing I like about this is that the missiles are kind of slow. Especially if you're sp uh, speeding up. So let me get a, get to a far distance here. And let's go for this one. When I'm speeding up, yeah, see the missiles get tracked behind me. But once I break off the attack, there's gonna be like a bombardment of missiles just going at it <laughs> against the uh, ships. Nah, I kind of like that. So need to do a little more damage to this one too. Ooh, if I, is our frigates okay? Yeah, our frigates are pretty fine. With the Empire, of course we're fine. Nice. Gotta take care of this one, and then we'll go back to destroying, uh... Well, I mean, we can also, like, just tag along on different stuff, so that's fine. Oof. Come on, boys. Gotta destroy these uh, ships. Oh yeah, but I mean, I don't. I could have. I knew I was gonna state something about the E-wing, but I, I wasn't sure if anyone was interested about the E-wing. But basically, the E-wing was supposed to be replacement for the X-wing, but because of technical glitches and problems with the ship, it didn't really get switched out at all. And the rebels, especially the like known rebels or republic trooper or republic pilots just wanted to keep their x-wings because you know it's familiar and didn't want to 
change uh, systems and stuff like that, you know? So. Go to destroy the engines. Yeah, this thing's a beast. TIE Defender's a beast against cruisers and stuff like this. I mean, it's good against Starfighters too, but like I said earlier, like, it's not... For some reason, the it won't lock on. Or sometimes it won't lock on, and when it does, it doesn't, you know. Fire the missiles and lock onto it, and lock onto the uh, things, to, the the tings, so you can't do much damage. What is this sensor ray? Nice. Sensor relay, whatever. Sen I oh I keep hearing announcers say sensor array instead of relay, but uh, I guess it's just my hearing being broke. And yeah, actually, after this, I'm gonna plan on being the the new the new Republic, uh, just to show off the E-wing a little bit. But after I show off the E-wing, I'm gonna steal a Tie Defender <laughs> and blow up the a lot of the stuff because it's faster that way to destroy the critical systems like that. Oof. So now it's I guess it's time to destroy some. Fighters. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and go back into the hangar. I haven't really attempted this yet, but I don't know if any other ship has this problem. Not the bomber. I'm going to take an interceptor with me. Also, fun fact, uh, you need to complete, I believe, 20, like, in actual Star Wars. In order to become a TIE Defender pilot, I think you need, like, to successfully do 20 missions with the... Yeah, successfully do 20 ace missions with a TIE Interceptor in order to become a TIE Defender, I think. Wow, okay. So yeah, in case you guys feel like <laughs> in the next life to become a TIE Fighter pilot, or to uh, become a TIE Defender pilot, I'm going to pour, I don't know. In the next life, what am I talking about? That is a K Wing, a heavy bomber, and it's going to freaking crash into nothing. I just killed it though. What? How? Oh, me dodging. The oh, those things just came back and freaking. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Actually, mmm. Give me this. I'm just gonna go ahead and go get aboard this and just clear out some pilots. Or kill some pilots. I should probably destroy the TIE Defender so that they don't steal the specs and start making their own good ships. No! Dang it! I hate it. I hate that when it happens. Like, you just, you just need to get that one kill and then victory happens. Like, ah, oh, man. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and switch over to the, um, the New Republic side, so I'll see you guys when we get over there. Alrighty, and we are back with the, uh, New Republic. So, uh, where's the E-Wing? There it is. So yeah, this is what the E-Wing looks like. There's actually supposed to be an astromech on there. Very similar to the X-Wing, just a little bit, but again, like, the only problem is that this thing has, like, a bunch of technical glitches, so... It's not as versatile, not as good as the other ships, like the X-Wing, so... Nice. Yeah, but this thing anyway is a beast in this in this uh, mod. Like that, like it has th a three missile barrage, but it takes a lot of freaking health away, or the health is very weak. Surprised I got killed by a turret. Oh crap! I actually want to get back into an E-wing. Thank you. I actually never die that quickly. That's so surprising to me. Oh, freaking dang, got wrecked. I mean, I could go inside the, uh, uh, ship so I can disable the shields quicker. Gotta be careful, though. 
Get over here. If only melee was in this game. There we go. Oh, dang. You just had to get health, bro. Yeah, I'm gonna die. <laughs> well, that was a fail. Yeah, uh, well, yeah, let's be a marine. Let's see if the K, if the K-Wing will come back. Actually, first playing this mod, or on the New Republic side, I didn't even realize that this, that this K-Wing was here. Actually, that's pretty cool, the ball turrets on here. Yeah, that's really cool, I like that. Oh, God, it goes really high. That's crazy. Oh, dang, the... Whoa! I should use this thing. Yeah, what the heck? This thing it tears down the shields like it's nothing. Like it's... Oh, man. Holy... Okay, like I said, it's a heavy bomber. Of course it's gonna do damage like that. God dang, dude. Whoa! This thing... Okay. I th this thing's a beast. <laughs> Actually, I should have said it before. I should have said it earlier, I don't know why I didn't say it earlier, but this is basically the highlight of the mod. The E-Wing, the TIE Defender, and the K-Wing. Jeez, this is crazy. Oh, man. Oh, it just got quiet. The Bomb Scatter, I actually like that. That's actually pretty unique for a ship like this. Oh! Nice. Oh, dings. I think that was an A-Wing that tried to crash into me for no reason. Nice. I'll just do this for fun. Um, unless the other scattered bombs are coming from... Yeah, so those scat so those scattered bombs aren't coming from me. They're coming from a, a co-pilot or the extra person from the other uh, cockpit. Oh hi! <laughs> I didn't kill him, but he 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 just died. Oh cr oh come on! I was I was pressing the space bar. Oh, you're serious? Okay. Well, time to uh. Use the E-Wing again. And uh, I just want to... Ow, crap. I just want to go ahead and use this for destroying the shields in the back. Dang, the sensor, the sensor array, though. Or re relay is uh, almost down, though. Actually, I could kill this thing. Hang on. With regular blasters. Oof. So, yeah, if you want to check this... If you guys want to check this mod out, link is always in the description. Or you can always head to ModDB and find it. It's actually one of the more recent mods. I don't. I'm surprised that. I don't. I actually don't know. I haven't been like actually like monitoring. But uh, I don't know if anyone else has played this uh, certain map yet. But it's pretty cool. I would definitely recommend it. Yeah, definitely. This mod can definitely improve. So, like one of the things they need to add for the is the Tide Defender, uh, missile locking. You know. And yeah, this thing, actually, you know what, this thing has incredible, uh, speed, power, and it doesn't, like, run out as, uh, quickly as any other ship, so that's, uh, surprising. Alright, oof, actually, this is almost, probably almost, a, yeah. Alright, let's see if we can blow up another internal system with this. Holy crap, we won! Okay, I thought I was gonna be using the TIE Defender for the rest of this, but, dang, we one with that that's crazy alrighty well I hope you guys enjoyed it uh, I'll see you guys later may the force be with you and have a safe and fabulous day alright peace guys